So today, what we're going to discuss is dog food labels. Very specifically on your dog food label, we are talking about the AFCO statement. AFCO is the Association of American Feed Control Officials and is basically the FDA for dog food. AFCO has been guiding feed regulators and ingredient definitions, label standards, and lab standards for over 110 years. The reason we're going to talk about this today is because what you feed your dog can impact their health and, of course, why we're here today, a bunch of dog nerds, it can affect their behavior. Have you ever guys been all too jacked up? Maybe one too many energy drinks, maybe a couple extra cups of coffee one morning. Uh, maybe you get the grandkids all jacked up on candy before they go back to their parents. We've all had that over energized feeling. Well, you know, your dogs can also experience that all jacked up feeling if there's too much sugar or overabundance of calories. They have to burn that off almost always that's expressed in inappropriate behavior. I've had my hands on 10,000 dogs in my career. I've never seen a dog that was over energized that decided to wash your dishes or fold your laundry. It's always going to be an annoying dog behavior. And you might try to curb that behavior by uh, not understanding that they are just got to burn that energy off instead of uh, trying to correct the behavior, take them for a walk, burn it off uh, appropriately. So how do we find out what's going on? Well, every bag of dog food has to have an AFCO statement. Usually this is around the ingredients list. There are some tricky terms that you should know about, and I will show you why I choose to feed my dog what I feed him. There are statements that have underlying meanings. Red flags if you see this quote. This food was formulated to meet standards for all life stages. If you see all life stages, that actually means they did the minimum. All life stages means that the food has to meet the requirements of a nursing mother. Can you believe that? What if you have an adolescent male or a working dog? Does that dog need the same nutrition a nursing mother does? I don't think so. So what happens with AFCO? If you wanted to have, let's say, a sweet potato salmon senior recipe, you would go to AFCO, present what you want. They would give you a recipe. You take it back to your factory. You cook it up. You put it in a bag and boom, it's on a shelf in every... Uh, local pet store, big chain store, grocery store, done. Well, that's fine. It's not going to make dogs sick per se, uh, but there are some better options. Now, uh, that food, the food that I feed uh, my dog still goes through the same AFCO testing and standards. The AFCO statement on the bag that I feed my dog says this food was animal tested. That's a big, big difference. So doing the minimum all life stages means we just get our recipe, we cook it, we put it in a bag, we sell it. If it says this food was animal tested, they went to AFCO, they got their recipe, they cooked it up. Then they did tests to substantiate. It does what it says it does. It has what it says it has in it. Then it goes in the bag, then it hits the shelf, then it goes in my dog. That's why I choose to feed what I feed my dog. This is not a, this food's better than that food. This is just information for you to make the best decision for yourself and your dog. What makes you happy and uh, what works for your dog's health and stage of life. When it comes to my dog, I want the best and appropriate uh, and what's appropriate for his stage of life and nutritional needs. Make sure you check your dog food label the next time you buy food for your dog. My name is Shane Gentry. I'm the owner of Sally Said So Professional Dog Training. Again, make sure you hit us up online. Check out our social media. Send us an email. If you want to find out more about this subject, feel free to call or email and set up a Zoom consultation. And we will get you set up no matter where you are on the planet. In closing, I'd just like to say, go out there and be the person that your dog thinks you are. Sally Said So. Here we go.